test. Rockers think rappers are rhyming fools who love to say their name and brag about their bling. Rappers think rockers are loud, big-haired, plaid shirt-wearing idiots that love to turn it up to 11. It is a very special episode of Rockers versus Rappers. Boom. Tonight, we have rockers Joel and Jeff versus rappers Derwitz and Joel One of these teams will get to play for 10 Gs. The other will go home and turn down for what just happened to our team. Joel and Jeff, you are playing first. Welcome to the game. Thank you. You guys look very much like rockers. Thank you. Thank you. We are. In this first round, you and your partner will work together. Keep in mind the correct answer is always somewhere on the screen. This first test begins at $300, but every second you don't answer, you will lose 20 bucks. And the money will <coughs> not stop till the test is complete. You get it right, you put that money in your bank. You get it wrong, or we're out of time, you get nothing. Is that all cool? Oh, yeah. All right, rock and roll. Your first idiot test begins now. Which of these will let you see through walls? Okay, you locked in with 180 on your money meter. What'd you do and why? Uh, I picked the window because you can actually see through a window which is placed inside of a wall. You're telling me that this telescope cannot see through a wall? It cannot. How about these x-ray goggles this young lady's wearing? That's bull honky. Is that bull honky? <laughs> that is the least rock and roll way you could have said that. But you got it right. 180 in your bank. Yeah! Durbin and Mel Segundo. Yeah. Welcome to the show. Thank you, Robert. Hey, Hip hop, hello. What's up, nice Mr. to meet you. What's going on, Mr. Green? Are you a rapper with the sweater or Bill Cosby? What is happening here? <laughs> I'm more of like a Biggie Smalls, you know. Oh, I like that. I'm a Biggie like fan myself. Baby. Yeah, I like that. It was all a dream. Yeah. Hopefully, it won't be. If you win this, it'll be in reality. <laughs> Are you ready to play? Oh ready. yeah. All right, your first idiot test begins now. Which actor just got the role? Okay, she has some sushi rolls, dude. You want to get her? I love the sushi though. Sushi? The roll. Sushi? Yeah, we'll go with sushi. sushi. Okay, you just locked in with $80 on your money meter. You touched the lady with the flowers. Why? She got rolls. She got sushi rolls. Not the fat kind, but like the rolls. Right. Sushi. Also, the word roll, the <coughs> acting roll would have been R O L E. Woo! <laughs> so it. <laughs> I don't know if one question could be a roll, but if so, you are on it because you got 80 bucks in your bank. <laughs> Done. Jeff and Joel, you guys are in a band. Yes. What's the band called? Uh, a thorn for every heart. A thorn for every heart. For that, every heart. That is pretty emo right there. <laughs> I like that. I would say so. I like that. What makes you guys think you're not idiots? Well, because we're not rappers. Oh. oh. Shots fired. That was Shots cold. fired. Shots fired. Why do you think that rock and roll is better than rap? Cause rap, rap is like scissors, they, they always miss the rock. Sorry. <laughs> you guys are very good. And as you can see, your rock and roll wasn't bended for guys who don't sing that great. Yeah. <laughs> you guys ready to keep on moving? Oh, yes. oh we're ready to rock. Ready to plug on through? Mm -hmm. All right, your next idiot test begins now. Where are you most likely to find 21 year olds? 20 one year olds. Ah, so that's gonna be. Are right, you locked in with $100 your money meter? You touch toddlers only social club. You realize cleverly the question does not say 21 year olds, as in 21 year old people, which could be either the bar, the university, or the maximum security prison. But. Toddlers Only Social Club is where you find 21-year-olds. And thankfully, this place is BYO Breast Milk. <laughs> you got that right? Yeah! 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 and Mel Segundo. That's your rapper names. Of course. What makes you guys think you're not idiots? I graduated college, fit mad knowledge, finna make this money, buy myself a cottage. <laughs> I like that. Yeah. that was a good run. And there is nothing more hip hop than living in a cottage. Nothing. No. Put a coochie sweater on all day. 
Why do you guys think that hip hop is better than rock? I don't know. Their lyrics just don't sing like there's that many lyrics to it. It's just like a bunch of emotions and singing and like when you get down to it, there's not that much intellectual content there. And you're right. They don't say about anything important like bling and cars. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. You ready for your next idiot yeah. test? It's coming at you right now. <coughs> what is Tom taking a picture of? Uh, no, it's going to it have to be a circle, dude, because his camera is a circle. Wait, he's not taking a picture of me, dude. Oh, nothing. It's like... Nothing. Uh, 60 bucks. No. You locked in. Yeah. The 60 bucks right. the money meter. What'd you do? Why? Because the camera lens is closed and you can't take pictures like that. At least uh, that's that's what I heard. I don't know. Right. You definitely want that. You guys definitely got that right. Gangster move. 60 bucks. <laughs> But do not stress, in our next round, we're giving away more money than Taylor Swift dances at award show to show people, I get it, I understand hip hop, we'll be right back. Taylor Swift, I think she gets it, she thinks she gets it. Rappers Darwitz and Mel Segundo are trailing with 140, you get to go first. Mel Segundo, yes. you're a professional Rapper. And musician. Do you want to uh, rap a little for us? Sure, sure. Do it. Uh, why don't we talk this way? Different dialects and disrespect. Negative images glorified the white lies. Written me this as a witness. What? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't understand one word of that. Cool. Me neither did I. You ready to play? Yes, let's do it. All right, here's your next idiot test. She's looking for love. Touch where she will definitely see it. <laughs> okay, uh... Love. Love. Ah. Hey, you locked in with 150 on your money meter. You touched a woman's shirt. Why? I don't know. They had hearts on it. It seemed like lovely. Listen, it says hate on her shirt. But the way it's written, this cursive, if you reflected it in this mirror right over there, it would spell love. L O V E. Like in the question. Oh, the mirror is the answer. Mirror. Got it. Yep, you did not get that right. I'm gonna go over here. <laughs> Yeah, good to see you, man. You ever been on tour? I have, yeah. Ever doing a show and all of a sudden everybody's staring at you and you have to quickly solve a brain puzzle? That's happened at least twice. At least twice before. It, you went on work tour, right? Yeah, we went on work tour. Tell me about that experience. Uh, in Texas, it was like 150 degrees and raining. Don't you hate those 150 degree Texas days? Yes, I do. My God, so hot that it becomes implausibly hot and there couldn't even possibly be the temperature. That was the worst. I see what you did there, Ben. Are you ready for your I test? I am so ready. Did you test? I am. It comes at you right now. Hit record. Okay, you locked in with 275 on the money meter. Tell me what you did and why. Uh, I got the REC in there. What did the question say? Hit record. Hit record! The question says, hit record. You might have read it as hit record. But this on the wall is not a record. Down here on this turntable, it's got a weird donut bagel hybrid. Yeah, I don't know what that is. You hit record. Nice and done. You got a hit record. Release 275 with Dan Corns it. Their lead is expanding. Nervous. Their lead is spreading, man. It's all good, man. Do you know what your sweater matches? Uh... Your eyes. Nope. <laughs> your sweater matches everything. Okay. Well, it's a good sweater. I like that. Thank you, sir. Your deep test starts now. According to the nursery rhyme, what did Jack jump over? Jack jumped over the beanstalk. Locked in a 175 in the money meter. What did you do and why? I want to say he jumped over Beanstalk. I, I, don't, I haven't heard that rhyme in a long time. Jack and the Beanstalk is a story. It's not a rhyme. You're forgetting one of the classic original raps, really. Jack be nimble. Jack be quick. Jack jump over the candlestick. Whew, God, right man. over there on the left. Ooh. <laughs> That's okay because as we learn from hip-hop, more money, more problems. <laughs> We're going right over here. Joel. Yes. 
Good to see you, man. Nice to see you also. What was your greatest moment on stage? Uh, we played a New Year's show in San Diego uh, at Soma, and I heard my specific name called out by somebody out in the crowd. They said, Joe, Joe. And I was like, that's me. That's me. That's awesome. Man. That's cool. I just hope that the person was not on their cell phone. Joel, Joel, hello. <laughs> you never know. Joel, are you there? All right, man, your next idiot test begins ahorita. All right. Which two combined to form eight? Well, I'm going to go with... That's really hard to read, baby. Uh, which two combined to form eight? Oh, man. <coughs> $100. $50, uh, $25. I don't understand what happens when I yell at people, time is running out, and they decide, I'm just going to wait this one out. I'm going to see how it works out if I touch nothing. I also enjoyed your very strange serpentine-like rock and roll approach to this test. You were like, oh, man. 